Ford Expedition Expert Review Of Ford's many SUVs, the Expedition is the largest. In production since 1996, the Expedition has three rows of seats and is offered in standard or extended length max body styles. Although carrying capacity is the Expedition's forte, Ford also uses it to showcase new technology and features, such as big infotainment displays and self-driving capability. The Expedition competes against the Chevrolet Tahoe and Jeep Wagoneer in the full-size three-row SUV category. It's always appreciable when a vehicle drives smaller than it is, especially when that vehicle is a hulking full-size SUV. The Ford Expedition does exactly that, moving with refinement that belies its body on frame construction and sizable proportions. Accurate steering helps it feel agile, and ride quality is typically smooth and quiet. The twin-turbo V6 is responsive, tows admirably, and does a good job of matching the power output of some V8 engines, although it gets V8-like fuel economy despite its relatively small displacement. The enhancements added for 2022 nicely freshened up the Expedition's interior. Despite the available 15.5-inch infotainment touchscreen's impressive size, our experience with it makes us think the smaller, standard 12.0-inch unit is better. Regardless, passengers in every row can stay comfortable and occupied with their vents, cup holders, and USB ports. There's plenty of space, even in the third row, but some newer competitors provide more interior capacity. Revealed for 2018, this generation of Expedition is starting to look a bit familiar but Ford has made an effort to keep it fresh with cool specifications and impressive tech. Considering its good driving manners, diverse capabilities, and laudable safety scores, the Expedition remains highly ranked among full-size three-row SUVs. Every Expedition is powered by a 3.5-liter twin-turbocharged V6. That's connected to a 10-speed automatic transmission, with RWD standard and 4WD available. The engine produces 380 horsepower and 470 pounds to foot of torque as standard, but in the Timberline and Stealth Edition trims, it's tuned up to 440 horsepower and 510 pounds to foot in our testing of models with a standard output engine and 4WD, 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration ranged from 6.2 to 6.9 seconds, with a longer time coming from the bigger Max version. A Timberline model we tested hit 60 miles per hour in 5.3 seconds. If fuel economy for the 2023 Expedition resembles that of years past, it should get about 17 23 of a mile per gallon city slash highway with RWD, and 16 20 seconds of a mile per gallon with 4WD. Expect max models to be slightly less efficient. Additionally, the 2022 Explorer Timberline was rated at 15 19 of a mile per gallon. The Ford Expedition earns the NHTSA's highest 5-star overall crash safety rating for 2023. Standard driver assist and active safety features in the 2023 Expedition include front automatic emergency braking, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, lane keep assist, and automatic high beams. Higher end trims add adaptive cruise control, rear automatic braking, enhanced front automatic emergency braking with pedestrian detection, intersection collision mitigation, and evasive steering assistance. Blue Cruise is Ford's level 2 driver assist technology that enables hands-free driving and was added to the Expedition for 2022. On stretches of designated pre-mapped highway, dubbed Blue Zones, Blue Cruise allows a driver to take their hands off the steering wheel and feet off the pedals, letting the vehicle do the driving. Onboard sensors monitor the driver to ensure they're still paying attention to the road ahead. As of now, Blue Cruise is only available on the range-topping Expedition Platinum trim, but it may eventually trickle down to others in the range. As standard, the Expedition comes equipped with a 12.0-inch infotainment touchscreen. If that's not large enough, a 15.5-inch unit is included on higher-end trims. Both come with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, built-in navigation is offered on a subscription basis. In place of the standard analog gauges, a 12.4-inch digital gauge cluster can be equipped. The first and second rows have USB ports, third row USB ports and a wireless charging pad are optional or included depending on trim. Second row riders can stay occupied with the optional rear seat entertainment system, which adds displays to the backs of the front seats. A six-speaker audio system is standard, while 12 and 22-speaker premium arrangements from Bang & Olufsen are available. Ford offers a few specialty versions of the Expedition that elevated from an everyday family hauler. One is the Stealth Edition Performance Package, which is offered as an upgrade on the limited trim. As its name suggests, the Stealth Edition comes with blacked-out exterior trim, 22-inch wheels, and dark-tinted lights. 
It's not only for show, in addition to the 440 horsepower engine tune, the Stealth Edition gets brake and suspension changes to enhance its sporty feel. For a different type of performance, the Expedition Timberline is available. This model increases the SUV's off-road capability by way of burly all-terrain tires, trail-tuned suspension that raises the ride height, metal skid plates borrowed from the F-150 Raptor, and trail turn assist from the Bronco. The Timberline's engine makes 440 horsepower, too. It looks the part, as well, featuring a roof rack, orange trim details, black wheels, and stylish green interior upholstery.